So Harold and Bert, Harold played by John David Washington, Bert played by Christian Bale, meet uh, in war and Valerie is a nurse. So they all meet in Belgium and um, she treats them and they all uh, kind of run off to Amsterdam together where they have this kind of golden bubble of time in Amsterdam and um, and it's just kind of that thing that they always carry with them that they had this time in Amsterdam and then they don't see each other for many years well Valerie doesn't see them, see them for many years and uh, kind of when they're all flung back together they caught up in this murder and conspiracy plot so during lockdown yeah I just started making art like she would and it was really fun and bizarre I mean she's she's a quirky bizarre kind of character anyway but her art is also very you know has a lot to say about life and mortality and innocence and power and all these kind of themes but it's also maybe disturbing for some people so I uh yeah I would I spent a lot of time making <laughs> my husband literally thought I was losing my mind in, in lockdown um I was making masks and I was found all these like I'd have like glass eyeballs and mannequins and dolls and these x-rays of deformities and shrapnel and babies and like all this and I'd have like make these little short films with my super 8 camera and um and some of that footage is in the movie actually I was I watched a cut of the movie and I was like oh my god that's my super 8 movie I'm I'm because I sent everything to David of course um, so that was really, really cool to see that pop up. I, know, I get the impression that he's someone that's just like watched people a lot and understood that in certain situations when something really big and scary is happening, actually something really small and hilarious can be happening at the same time. I feel like he does that a lot in his, in his films and certainly in this film. There'll be moments where it's kind of like big world ending sort of stakes, but then actually they're just all caught up in their own small thing which can be really hilarious. I love, I love it when, when directors kind of mix drama with comedy in that way. Otherwise it's just a bit too much to take, isn't it? I think that would definitely be Valerie's point of view too. So if you didn't find the humor and you didn't find the beauty, you just couldn't do, you couldn't do it. <laughs> it's just too much. I mean, there was a lot of very, very funny people on this set and very comedically gifted actors a part of the ensemble cast so as you can imagine a lot of improv and a lot of breaking the scene because everyone's just laughing I'd say anytime Mike and Michael so Mike Myers and Michael Shannon anytime they'd start riffing on bird watching stuff I mean we were just, we were just like completely undone I mean there's so many takes that I don't think anyone could have used because and I remember thinking at the time, I was like, this is like, this will never be in this. How could this possibly be in the movie? And then honestly, when I watch the movie, it's like my favorite parts when they, when they talk. But I mean, there is so much footage of them talking about birds and it was so funny. It's, it's, but that's like why there's, there's so many great little duos on camera, whether you've got like Alessandra and Matthias, like the two cops is like this one little duo, or you've got, you know, Mike and Michael, like the, you know, there's like all these like little duos and they're so, everyone's so funny. And you're so pleased when they pop up on screen. But it's funny that you can have someone who's so known for their comedy, like Mike Myers, with someone who's so known for their drama, like Michael Shannon, and then they can just riff off each other and be hilarious and, and serious and moving and all those things. I mean, it was just, it's so funny. Saying like Matthias is thought to be thought of as such a you know dramatic actor as well, and he's he's hilarious. And Christian's obviously like, I mean Christian can do literally anything. He's so so funny. Same. I mean everyone was just so so good, so talented. It's really charming and magical, and propulsive, and it's like both people's tiny little worlds and the big world at the same time, if that makes sense.